And I'm Elizabeth. And this is the Lily Elizabeth Cooking Show. From now on, we're going to introduce a new, like, thing quirky. called Quirky Kitchen Gadgets. And I got one right here. Just kidding. Everybody has one of those. Every um, mother, at least. What is it, Lily? What do we have today? Show them. <laughs> um. What is that? I don't know. Like, this thing my dad brought back from, like, Korea. No, he brought it back from Vietnam. Vietnam. And as you can see, it's tequila with a cobra in it. Can you see the cobra? It's real. <laughs> Just kidding. It is a real cobra, though. We've never <laughs> taken a shot out of it because... I don't know. God knows what, what's in there. So that's our quirky gadget for today. We have lots of them, so we're going to introduce them during the shows. So, Lily, what are we making today? Personalized bruschetta. Ooh, sounds delicious. Do you like the black? I feel like I look like I'm graduating high school or something. I don't know. Do you? Well, you like the black? Yeah. Okay. So, what we do first, we're making personalized bruschetta, right? Is that what you said? Mm-hmm. Yeah, okay. I'm deaf and I forget things, so, so I'm getting old, so. Yeah. Um, yeah okay. So, Lily, what are you doing Speaking, first? this Friday is Dad's birthday. Oh, my gosh. What are we going to get him? We're going to cook him a nice dinner. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Give him a shoulder rub, foot rub. He's the best. So, okay. Happy birthday, Dad. Happy birthday, honey. Okay, so we're going to broil. Put it on. Broil. Broil. Um, look on the market first. Nope, it's not that. Okay. Broil. On low. You do the butter. She's going to melt the butter, and we're going to put the garlic in there with the butter. A whole stick. We might not use the whole stick, but we love butter and garlic. And I am going to cut the bread, the French bread. Look at that, baby. Mm. <laughs> I love the smell of bread. <laughs> bread reminds me of my girlfriend, Lynn. She loves bread. She's a tiny little thing, too. You would never think that she eats so much damn bread. I mean, darn put bread. Put it back, put it back. It's a family show. Okay, so you cut the bread in half. I hope I cut it evenly. I'm a little... There. Okay. So, ingredients, though? Ingredients. Okay. Um, we're putting tomatoes, mozzarella cheese, <laughs> asparagus, small Don't asparagus. get it confused with parsley. <laughs> and red peppers. Mm. Oh, and blood. Oh, ooh, that garlic smells delish. Garlic um, butter. And basil, of course. Our basil tree is on its last leg, so we have to get another one. It's funny. All right. So we're gonna make just. I'm gonna cut this one in half because. Your father doesn't like all the fancy stuff. He just likes garlic bread and cheese, so I'm going to make him a special one because we will save this piece for later. It's a pepper. Okay, get your garlic. Okay. It smells so good. And then just take the garlic, the fresh garlic and the butter. And come on, Lil. Um, so Lather it on the bread. Don't be shy. Put as a lot of it on. Grab some of that garlic in there. Okay. And I saved a piece for your father for later. I'm going to do this piece for... This one? Little Derek. He just got home from his play practice. He's a lion in, a, in the 
play and um, he's yeah, being good, so I'm gonna make him something. Vincent? Okay, I don't have any fresh garlic. See the garlic? You gotta get the garlic on there. There we go. Vincent! Oh no! This is a Vincent. He always tries to get. Say hi, Vincent. You can't have any of that. Go away. Oh boy. He's trouble. Vincent! Go! Okay, now that we have the garlic on there, um, we, we put everything you want on. What are you going to put on yours, Lil? I'm going to put... I'm going to put a little tomato. I want to use the peppers because your brother doesn't... Does your brother like peppers? I can't... I don't know if he does or not. Red peppers? Maybe. He like likes one thing like one day and then like different and then he doesn't like. Men like day. that. They like options and they like variety. Vincent, go away. He always has to disturb every show. We're gonna make him part of the show if he keeps it up. Then I'm gonna put some asparagus on mine. I just throw it on there. It's so easy. I mean, come on. And delicious. Can I put them? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put a couple peppers on. If Derek doesn't like them, you can take them off. Then I'm going to put some fresh mozzarella cheese on mine. Lil, what are you doing? She's eating everything already. Dipping the bread in the garlic sauce. and okay. Oh, look at that. Look how delicious that looks. Looks pretty good. And then... All I'm going to do is grab some salt and pepper, which is over there. Because I'm pretty sure that I ate all of it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that I ate all of it. Pepper. Oh, little Derek doesn't like a lot of pepper. It's easy if you make it yourself because then you know what you like. So. Is that all you're putting on yours, little Tomatoes, peppers, and cheese? What about asparagus? Basil. Oh yeah, I forgot basil on mine. I always forget the darn basil. Don't forget the wine, though. I find that wine is... Your little jokes about wine, they're so funny. <laughs> you think you're funny. No. You are. Most times. So I'm gonna just throw some basil on mine. Just throw it on there. Don't be shy. It smells so delish. Would you like some more? I'm sure. It smells so good. Love the smell of basil. Okay. So these are our snacks. Okay, now we're going to put it in the oven for a very short time. Hopefully we won't burn them this time. Oh my, yours is huge. Oh goodness, okay. And you stick it in the oven. You want to put it in the oven? Sure. Watch your hair now. Your hair. Okay, stick it in there. It doesn't take very long at all. Very easy. All for a dollar ninety-nine. No, just kidding. <laughs> no, but it isn't that expensive. I mean, it's probably under ten dollars, right? So, what can we talk about why the bruschetta is cooking? Let's put it on for a couple minutes so we don't forget. How long does it, put it go on for? It takes about two or three minutes. Okay. So, um. oh, Lily has something too. I want to thank my Uncle George for getting me this, these um, mitts from cooking mitts from Paris. Aren't those cute? The real Paris. Someday we'll go there, huh? Sure. And eat some cool French food.
Is it getting it all right? I see a little bit of a shadow there. There. You see it? Yeah. All right, while we're waiting for the cook, let's see if you could catch this cheese in your mouth. Ready? Oh, miss. You look. Oh, miss. Here's a tomato. Get over here. Oh. <laughs> Open. Don't get on my chin. Wait, wait, I'll do it. Okay. Scooch over. Hmm? See if you can get it in my mouth. No. Oh, yeah. yeah I got it. I got it. <laughs> Hello. Try and get it in my mouth now. Throw it. Ugh, I like cheese. It. Do cheese. It went on top okay. of the fridge. It went on top of the fridge. It went in my wine. No, it didn't. Ready? Ready? Nice. I got it. Good job. No room. Oh, it's almost done already. Get some more fruit brush. <laughs> oh yeah, we gotta oh get that fruit brush over there. No. Show the fruit Why? brush. This is how Stuart's my eight-year-old son went shopping with his father. So he comes home and says, Look, Mom, I got some fruit rush. Yeah, fruit rush. My ass. More like sugar rush. Mom. I would never buy this for my kids. Never. It's this one. Okay. Well done. Give you. Where's your uh, thing? All right. See how fast that was? All done. Look at how delish that looks. And you can put anything you want on it. And that's going to be a snack for after school today. What do you think, Lil? She's going to have a sugar rush after that drink. Watch out. Oh, put that on there. I'm going to put it down. It's hot. Excuse me. Want to try a little bite? Let's try a little bite. Try a bite of yours. It only takes like three minutes to cook on broil. That's pretty good. All right, can you pick yours up? No. Okay, take a bite of mine. Ready? Bon appetit! Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> good. Hey, that's mine. Oh. I use fresh ingredients, that's the best. Mm. Bye! Bon appetit!